Hey guys, hey, Tribal Gore here. How you all doing? Today is NFL Picks Week 13. Yeah, Week 13. Um, I'm gonna have more gaming videos uh, tomorrow. I'll probably start doing them again. I know I've been missing a lot of days. I've been just doing these weekly videos. Uh, and the holiday break is coming. I got like a month off, so... I can probably get into swinging things again, hopefully. And then, yeah, so let's get right into week 13 picks. If you guys are new to the series, um, I first go do the week before, then I'll do the next week. So I'll go week 12, week 13. And, uh, yeah, leave a like if you enjoy the video. Let's get it. So we got Vikings, Lions. So, this was a very good game. I was not surprised that the Lions won, but um, I thought the Vikings would have played better defense, and I had the Vikings winning. Let me get the paper. But, yeah, I had the Vikings winning. So, um, yeah. But, yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter. And then we got Redskins, Cowboys. I thought, you know, like an idiot, that the, the Redskins would win, but... You gotta give it to the Cowboys. I mean, they just had another amazing game. They're playing out of this world. I thought the Redskins would win to make the division a little closer to see if, like, you know, they could make a late run to get first place. But it looks like Cowboys are keeping their first place. So, yeah, good job to the Cowboys. Keep going, boys. Keep going, Ezekiel Elliott. And Ezekiel Elliott's got uh, the record, right? For, he beat Tony Dorsett's record for um, something. I forgot what it was. Oh, rookie rookie rushing record. Um, which I don't know how many yards it was, but he broke it. I think against the Redskins. If I'm wrong, let me know in the comments. Steelers, Colts. Of course, I had Steelers winning. They dominated the Colts. Colts aren't good. They're not going to the playoffs. Nothing, so... Good job to the Steelers. We got Bengals, Ravens. I had Ravens winning, I believe. I had Ravens winning. Yes, I had Ravens winning. Um, and yeah, so we got Bengals and Ra yeah, and good job to the Ravens. I figured that would happen. And then we got Saints, Rams. Um, man, Rams. Mm. Do I feel bad for you? Kind of. But, Jeff Fisher, you got to be better, man. You got to you gotta be better. Honestly, Jeff Fisher's got to leave. He's got to quit. No, they got to fire Jeff Fisher. He's holding them back. Um, But, yeah. You got Cardinals, Falcons. Um, I figure Falcons will win. Cardinals, I don't know what happened to them. I honestly don't know what happened to the, f the Cardinals. Uh, let me know if you guys know. I don't know if their defense just got worse or their offense got worse. But last year, they were eating. This year, they're playing like trash. I don't know what happened to them. But uh, one upside is David Johnson is just going off. He He plays good every game. So, I don't know. That gives you guys hope um, for the future. So, yeah, good job to the, uh, the Falcons. We got Dolphins and 49ers. Now, Dolphins, man, they're on fire. They're on fire. Like, they start, what, 1-4, and four, and they're on a six-game win streak. Other than the Cowboys, they're the one of the hottest teams in the NFL right now. And I think, no, no, yeah. They're one of the hottest teams in the NFL right now, and that's a big part to Adam Gase, which Bears let go, unfortunately. But uh, Adam Gase and, yeah, they're just on a roll. So, they're, they're in the playoffs. If they would, um, if they would uh, win, to, if, I mean, if playoffs started today, they'd be in. So, pff, let's see. Let's see how far Dolphins could ride this one out. I don't know how far they're going to ride it out. But we we just uh, hope and pray or whatever. I'm not really a Dolphins fan, but, you know, good luck to the Dolphins. And, yeah, we got Bills, Jaguars. I had Bills winning this game. 
Um, that puts the Bills back in the division. I'm pretty sure. Uh, a little bit, not much. They probably won't make the playoffs, but it it, it gives them hope. It gives them hope. We got Titans Bears. Now this game, <laughs> Matt Barkley played great. He played great. Um, you know, he never threw a touchdown. That was his first ever touchdown pass he ever threw. Um, but it, it gives Bears hope for the future, I guess. A little glimpse of hope. They just, I don't know what happened. Everybody's getting injured. I mean, they weren't good to begin with. I'm just saying, like, playing like trash. Um, but maybe we'll have a QB for the future. I don't know with Matt Barkley. We'll have to see. Jay Cutler's gone. Hopefully, Jay Cutler's going to be gone. And, yeah. We got Giants, Browns. Will Browns ever win a game? I don't know. We'll have to see. I think I might have a surprise uh, thing for you guys. But, Giants, uh, yeah, they won. Good job, Giants. And then you got Chargers, Texans. I thought Texans would win this game. That made the division a lot closer. I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken. Oh yeah, and Titans are uh almost could make the playoffs, but whatever. Um, we got Chargers, Texans. I'm pretty sure, if I'm wrong, I don't remember if Chargers are in that division or not. I'm pretty sure they are though. So, man, that's gonna make that division interesting. We got what? Texans, Colts are in second, Chargers, and then there's Titans. They're all right there within like one game of each other. So we'll have to see. We'll just have to hope. Uh, just see, see what happens. Oh man, we gotta talk about one team in particular. This team is out of this world. I don't know what happened. They flipped the script. They were playing terrible in the beginning of the season. I mean. They were awful, and they just turned it on, and that's the Bucks. They only let three points the whole game. The safety was by the offense, so they only gave three points to one of the best teams in the NFL, and they scored 14 on defense, or off, of, and they had like five turnovers. I don't know what's going on with the Bucks, but... Who's ever the defensive coordinator? Keep doing a great job because holy shit, that team looks on fire. I mean, they're on fire. So, we'll have to see in the coming weeks if they can make a playoff run. We'll have to see because they're certainly in the playoffs right now. Um, but yeah. Then we got Patriots, Jets. Patriots didn't play the good this game. They look lackluster. I don't know if they were tired, whatever it was. They got the dub, so that helps a lot. Um, you know. So yeah. Good job, Patriots. Panthers, Raiders, this game was amazing. I mean, gotta give it up to the Panthers, even though they're not making the playoffs this year. They uh, they played their asses off. They need to win that game to keep themselves in contention. They end up losing. But you got to give it to the Raiders. They're, this is their first winning season since 2002. So, congratulations to the Raiders and all Raider Nation. You guys might be going to the playoffs this year because it's not set in stone yet. But I see you guys making the playoffs. So, yeah. But Panthers, I don't know what happened. It was uh, Josh Norman or a series of injuries. But, you know, whatever it was, come out next year and prove everybody wrong. You got Chiefs Broncos now. Uh, uh, this game, man, it was crazy. I thought the game was over when Matt Prater um, was going to make that in uh, overtime. But he missed it. And Chiefs come back. Alright, no, maybe he, he might have missed it before overtime. I forgot. but And then the Chiefs. Barely make the kick. It bounces off the inner post and goes in. That's a game that everybody wants to see. Good job to the Chiefs. 
from winning this game, and I picked the Chiefs to win. And you know what? I'm not surprised that the Chiefs won. Broncos are just not as good as they were last year, so good job, Chiefs. Oh, man. And guess who's back? The man, the mint, the Rodgers. He comes back. He tells everybody before this game we're winning out no matter what. And I hate the Packers because I'm a Bears fan, so it's like, come on, Eagles, you gotta win this game. And Eagles are killing themselves, man. They're doing so good, and now they're last place, and it doesn't look good for them. You got Giants, who are um, eight and three. No, that's impossible. Huh? They might be okay. Giants might be seven, or no, that they they might be eight and three. I could be wrong, but I they might be eight and three. And then you got the uh, the Redskins in front of you, who are six and four. Four, seven and four, one of those, whatever it is. Um, uh, but Eagles, you gotta make a comeback now. So, I mean, they're be they gotta be better than last year, right? I mean, it can't get any worse than that, honestly. So yeah, now let's do picks for week thirteen. Um, week thirteen, it's Cowboys Vikings. Those jerseys look nice. I'm going to go with the Cowboys to win this one. Um, I'm going Cowboys because they're just on fire, man. They they just can't stop losing. I mean, they just can't stop winning. They just win every game. So, not every game. Obviously, if they won every game, they'd be love no. But they just can't. They're on a 10-game win streak. I don't see them slowing down. I think they're going to go 15-1. and one. Nah, just get 14 and 2. Those one. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe they will go 15 and 1. But they're in the playoffs right now. And Zeke and Dak, keep rolling your team and keep going. Chiefs fucking. Um, I got Chiefs winning this one. Um, I don't know. I think the Chiefs are a very good defensive team. And a very good offensive team. People say they don't trust Alex Smith. But, I mean, you gotta hand it to him. He's winning games. I mean, I would love to have Alex Smith on our team. But, you know, that's not gonna happen. So, yeah. Um, Lions Saints. I'm gonna go with the Lions to win this game. Um, yeah, they're just, they're just on fire too. Lions come out of nowhere and shock the world and they're in first place so because everybody thought Vikings were just gonna roll over the division because you know Teddy Bridgewater they had all the players back and Teddy Bridgewater gets hurt so we'll, we'll have to see if Lions can keep rolling and roll that into the playoffs Matthew Stafford is playing on an MVP level so we'll have to see then we got Pats and Rams of course I'm going with Tommy Boy to win this game. Broncos, Jaguars, of course. I'm going with the Broncos. Jaguars are terrible. I mean, they're terrible. We got Texans, Packers. I'm going to go with the Texans because I don't like the Packers, as I said, at all, every week. Eagles, Bengals. Eagles need to win this game. They better win this game because Bengals are trash. But for real, they need to win this game to get back in the division. So I'm going Eagles. Um, I'm going with the Dolphins, man. They're just too good. Dolphins. Dolphins. Then we got 49ers, Bears. This game will be close. I got 49ers. I can't go with the Bears. They're, they're, they're so bad. They're so bad. Bills, Raiders, Raiders. <laughs> That's an obvious one. Then we got Giants, Steelers, Giants. That's, I mean, I can see Steelers winning, but Giants just, they're the better team. Um, Redskins, Cardinals. Redskins, Cardinals are just not playing good right now. They're just playing terrible um they're playing terrible bucks chargers i'm gonna go with the hottest team one of the hottest teams right now in the nfl and that's the bucks i'm going with the bucks man bucks 
keep going. Um, Panthers, Seahawks. I'm going with the Seahawks. Seahawks are just amazing. So, yeah, Seahawks. Jets, Colts. I'm going to go with the Colts. Jets are terrible. Um, and my record overall is 90 and 60. So, we'll see if that continues with the good record or not. But, yeah, guys, sorry if, if it's a longer episode. Um, next week, I don't know if I'm going to show the standings. I might show the standings. Um, we, then the next four weeks, that would be week 14, 15, 16, and 17. So, yeah, this is week 13, right? Yeah, this is week 13 picks. And if you guys enjoyed it, let me know in the comment section. Press that like button. Subscribe if you're new. It's Rob McGordy. I love you all to death. And don't forget to peace the fuck out.